codes out of this world. Just trying to set up my laptop. So I hope everybody's having a good, wonderful day. Just setting up everything. It's hard for me to talk today, so. stuff over. Oh, that's much better. Hello, hello, how are you? Oh, okay. Let me see, I got this set up. Uh, let me see who that is. Okay, how are you? You gotta get that thumbs up. I appreciate it. I can't talk too loud. I got a, I got a sore throat. I'm trying to clear it up now. So what did y'all do today? I know it's beautiful outside. Okay, sure, I could shout your name out. It's rough. There's two people in here. Can I get them thumbs up? Okay. I can't see nothing on here. Um, I also have a channel. Can we be friends? Sure, we can be friends. I have no problem with that. We can always be our friend. Bell Kildred? Kildred? Oh, boy. My eyes are really... I'll kill it. Yeah, I, can I get them thumbs up, please? Can I get at least one? One thumbs up. Yeah. Uh, yeah, where were y'all at? I, 
I went live early. Yeah, I just went live. All right. All right, I, I'll be here. All right. Do, 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 do. I ought to play some music. I don't feel like getting up, getting that. All right. Is that pronouncing Bell Killer? Kit Kittle? I don't want to mess up your name. I can't barely see it. Nah, I want that type of thumbs up. Hit the um, the, um thing when you come inside. What's going on, Mukbang Terminator? What's up? What's up, man? Oh, boy, boy. I had the worst terrible day yesterday. I mean, I'm not feeling too good today because I got a slight cold, sore throat. <laughs> See, Bell, that's what I was talking about. When you come in, you got to hit that um, thumbs up. When you come in there live or just, just step out, hit it, and then come back in. Yeah, yeah. Let me see. I'm sorry to hear that. Is there like some particular? Yeah. I don't know. I don't know what's going on with these terrible colds. My lady friend, she was sitting there laughing at me. I gave a thumbs up. Thank you. That's what I've been trying to explain to the the uh, other twos in here to hit the hit the thumbs up, but they didn't want to, so they gave me a thumbs. <laughs> so yesterday I uh, I had to use the bathroom, and when you have trouble with diarrhea, you need to get to the bathroom. And I told my lady friend to hurry up. She wanted to take her sweet time, and she. Heard me, I like moaning and and trying to hold my butt together so nothing don't come out. Oh man, that's embarrassed. I let loose all over my inside my pants. <laughs> oh boy, boy, I had a, this terrible cold. And then last night, everybody wanted me to do a live video, but I couldn't. I I didn't know what was going on. I came down with a sore throat. Uh, I started getting real cold all of a sudden. I mean, I mean, I was cold. I mean, I got, I was under blankets. I, I was just literally freezing. And I knew then. I said, "Up, oh, I caught something," but by who? I don't know. Yesterday, I made a few comments on one of my live. Oh, yes, I think it was yesterday. Because I was eating um, pig, I mean, not pig, I almost said pig feet. Oh, my God. <laughs> hey, ASMR Michelle, how are you? I sure did. I, and she was, she was on the floor dying. I'm sitting there like, oh, Lord, no, no. I'm sitting there, I was like, oh, this is so embarrassed. I could not hold it no longer, and it just came out. I'm like, and she said, you're a grown man. You're not supposed to poop your pants. I'm like, you don't take all day in the bathroom. Hey, I still can't type in your chat. Huh, that's, that's, that is so weird. I don't know what's going on with that. <laughs> yeah, tell me about it. <laughs> oh, boy. 
Terminator, you and something else. I'm sitting there like, she said, boy, how did you do that? I told you I had to go. I mean, like, you, you can hold poop, but when it's come like soup, that becomes a problem. Oh, I couldn't hold it. My stomach, I kept feeling it. It just, just came straight out. Okay, all right, ASMR. I tell you, and then this morning I got up. I'm moving slow in the bank. I was in the bank. And they said, but what's the matter? Rico, you always happy and outgoing. I said, well, right now I got a cold. It's kicking my butt. I'm cold, I'm freezing, and this lady going to sneeze all over me. I said, lady, I already got a cold. I don't want your cold, too. Okay, I got an ASMR. Yeah, I, I got it. I seen it. Thank you. Long poop soup. <laughs> so right now, I'm, um, I got uh, clear tea with, um, Oh, I forgot what it is. But I know I got some thera flu and stuff like that. And cough drops. Oh, this is so miserable to have a cold. And then my mama gonna tell me, take the thera flu. Now you need to take it. I'm about to do a live video. I can't be taking that stuff. I let me see if this sleeps. Because that's something I need to know. I do not like taking medicine. Okay, I don't know what this is. Oh, this is awful cold, too. Oh, nighttime. Okay, that's good to know. And this is a thera flu. No stomach. It's messed up. Actually, you know what? To, to be eating all that bizarre food, my stomach should be messed up, but my stomach is not messed up. It's, it's what I ate before. I think it was the mussels. You know, I cooked them right. Hey, Jeff, how are you? And the mussels did not taste right. I don't know. I ate a few of them. Maybe I caught a stomach virus from off there. Good, good. OMG, I try that. And just had be core for two days. <laughs> you talking about the thera flu? This thera flu is evil. I had done with the video shot. Oh, for real? Oh, wow. I got to go over there and check it out. A long time ago. You know, you got to be careful when doctors give you medicine, too. Because I am, I mean, I've been on the most strongest medicine. Oh, I don't never forget that one day. Uh, let me see what day. Um, I don't know. I can't remember what day it was. But I was in the hospital, in intensive care. And my asthma was um, acting up. My pain on my left-hand side was... Uh, doing a number, <coughs> and the doctor them kept on um, saying, "Sit a tube in him, just give him something for pain. That pain is what was doing it, making his breathing." But it was just too late. And I'll tell you something: drilling something inside your leg is very uncomfortable. Oh man, I screamed and cried and. restaurant day after trying <laughs> but I think something was wrong with the muscles and I can't eat them and I like kept spitting it out I'm like uh uh and I always know like I said I know how to cook uh, fresh um, muscles and stuff and uh, the muscles I like no they gave me my money back though but they must knew something was wrong with them 
but I, I literally kept fighting with that, that damn, um, <laughs> oh, wow. It's the muscle. She got sick. Wow. Because I don't eat seafood like that, but when I want it, I want it. Them damn um, uh, uh, king crab legs got on my nerves. I didn't know how to open them. The shell popped on my shirt. I couldn't get the meat out. And my hands was all, I mean, literally, you can't see it, though, but I could feel where the prickly little things was on tearing up my hands. Uh, yeah, that's a common cold. Ugh. I said, well, for now on, I told them people in that grocery store, I'm going to mess with the bomb, the ones in the box. I, I'd rather eat them muscles. Then I know all I got to do is just really warm them up and they'll pop open. But I, I don't know. Some of them was super gooey. I mean, it, when I open it, I'm like, it I'm supposed to feel like this. What is wrong with these? Then I noticed the color on it too. It it, it it did not change, not one color to it. Yes, more. The way. I just let you know you you must don't eat too much seafood. Uh, let me see. What all did you top it with? Um. I have, I have shallot, garlic, uh, lemon juice, you no know, the the butter, you know, cooked it in that, and then I um had some um uh white wine. I was so mad. I'm like, no, that wine just became useless. I like, well, at least I I know I got it because I paid like forty dollars for that. So, um, I don't know what happened to them damn muscles. I had, uh, one, one red hot pepper in there. Chopped it up real good and, you know, I don't know. Oh, and the top of my head hurts. Every time I rub my head, oh, mm -mm. I know something. I came down with something. Oh boy. I just cannot wait until this live thing um one day builds up. But I'm gonna stay up on this thing until ten o'clock tonight and then I'm gonna get off. Cause I know I'm gonna have to get some sleep. I can't drink this stuff. This stuff is gross. I used to work for a restaurant. I had to pop their shells next time. Like put shells and a little a spice sauce, lemon, and other stuff. Okay, that sounds good right there. I used to have to make. Oh, wow. So that's one thing about working in a restaurant. You get to learn a lot of stuff. That stuff is awful. But it's, it's helping for my throat, though, so. Yeah. Um... 
I don't know what I'm going to be doing. I don't know if I want to do mug bangs. I don't know what I want to do anymore. I'm losing subscribers. Um, everything. Ever since that mess been going on. But I blocked that person off my Instagram, Twitter, YouTube. What's that? Oh. Okay, it's two watching right now. YouTube is going to. Oh, uh, wow, the dark side. Oh, uh, they're trying to find something on people. That, that's crazy, though. Same issue. Yeah, we know who it is, though. You know, eventually um, that person will be telling on themselves. I'm still at 1.4K. I'm good. Oh, uh, okay. Yeah, my. I don't got that many yet, but it, it, it'll eventually build up, though. I was thinking about uh, quitting YouTube because I said, oh, it's just bad. You don't want to be up on this thing because you got bad, stupid people want to put stuff in your. And you said, don't quit. All right. I'm taking your um, advice. I had some uh, yesterday was telling me don't quit. Because I'm not a mean person, I'm not a bad person, and I know for a fact I never cussed anybody out on this thing. They want to say they will drop you up the wall. Yes, me too. It will show that you are the one at the end. Yup, yup. Because, I mean, that person is just crazy. Uh, it's, that person is attacking a lot of people's channels. I had this one uh, one guy came in my live, and he said, I was told not to come in your live videos or regular videos. He, he sent it and told me i uh, take it down when I read it. Yeah, and I said, wow, we was on chit-chatting back and forth, and uh, he, he told me a whole lot of stuff. He said, that's the reason why he left that person alone, because information was being sent to him. So I don't know what's going on. It won't make it so crazy. I don't hate that person. I mean, I, I don't hate that person not at all, but I know for a fact I don't care for that person. Yeah, trolls account. And you'd be wondering like, damn, what did you do to deserve all this? Because you're only being truthful and up front talking about it. My attorney told me don't take down that darn video, which I did, but I still have a copy of all my um, videos I did take down. Fake it, fake name over and over again. Wow. That's all right. I'm eventually be catching on them. Now what, I, what I've been doing lately is keeping one eye open, the other one winking. Because I unsubscribe from my, all of them. And it's just start back all over again. And that's a shame. You have to do that. But because 
they 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 just I did a live stream last night and it was crazy in my life. Wow. Because the mug man tell me that you be you you don't hold your tongue. You 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 speak. You speak about it. If you feel something, you gotta talk about it. That's the only way to get it out there so people know what's really going on. Wow. Yeah, real people there in the restaurant was just damn fucking troll. <laughs> yes, I did. Another night. Wow. That's sad. That is truly, truly sad. And what, like I said, what make it crazy is the other YouTubers know what's what's really going on, but they they tied on the string. That's that person's uh she got a whole bunch of muppets. Dance, puppy, dance. One person controlling all of them. Brainwash. But it's all good, though. Yes, they're not speaking of something on Right, right. And that's that's the truth too. I mean, because maybe that person is not speaking like how like I'm doing, but I can't I can't bite my tongue. That person is sending text messages, email, calling, you know. I got to it's not a game. Right, it's it's definitely not a game. You you got. You got crazy people on here. You got stalkers. You have rapists. You got you got a lot of stuff on here. So I be I be hearing all, all the stuff they be having on here. And you got a lot of fake YouTubers that they don't know how to be real. They sit there and grin in your face and talk behind your back. <laughs> love you for that yeah I mean like I said before I got a lot of friends and a lot of family members there always say Rico don't bite his tongue he gonna, he gonna tell you if you wrong or you right you know I, I mean none of us did not deserve of that day but you know, but it is, it is what it is. At least I'm glad it came out, the truth about that person. Yeah. That's the one thing I can say. The, the, the ugliness came out. And I know a lot of other um, people kept saying that too. Wow, really? See, I don't think I can have them people coming up in my live video talking yang because I know me. I've been let loose like a firecracker. <laughs> like, who do you think you is? I mean, it's going to be why well, I ain't going to call them out their name, but it's going to be told. Somebody hit me up on Instagram uh, earlier. I don't know who this person was, so I just deleted it. Because it's all, it, I mean, it's literally drama on Instagram. Now I'm getting to the point that I hate it. You know, you, you, you're trying to build your platform and trying to do this like everybody else. And you got somebody try to knock you down. And they'll keep knocking you down. But they ain't knocking you down, but they knocking 
uh, new people is knocking you down where you can't get your subscriber numbers up and views up. You know what? Like I always say, God do not like ugly. I don't give a flying hoop how much to lower that person up. Hmm. No, you know you're wrong. You're wrong. It's as simple as that. Oh, man. Let me try to drink some more of this. And, uh, I mean, I, I hate talking about this stuff because it kind of like tears me down, but but I'm I'm good though. I'm watching them. Oh, I'm not watching them. Ah. Oh, I gotta see it up on here. Come on, get out my way. Wow. Really? <laughs> mm -mm -mm. Wow. We it's gonna be one day we really gonna grow our channel and we just have to keep haters and trolls out the way. Why well, yeah, I kind of like trolls. I don't care for the haters. Well, I hate us too. I mean, I like telemarker. I just let loose on them. Give them a piece of my mind. If they don't want to leave, they'll just stay there and still get um talked about. Just so they can leave and don't come in my live videos no more. I don't care how many thumbs I get down. I don't want trolls messing with me. I know they don't know you, but they pretend like they do. I really don't mind that troll to block the people who put who put in. Right, 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 right. That's the reason why I keep mods in mind. I got to have them. Because there was this one, this, I don't know, I think he had been a kid. He kept just saying off the wall stuff. I'm like, and then I forgot who was in there had a mod. They just deleted everything from him. I was reading something he said, it was just gone. I'm like, okay, I'll leave that one alone. And then, uh, hey, sorry, so, someone called. Oh, okay, okay. I still be here. Yeah, I'm gonna have to take that there food tonight. So I go to bed and I hope it helps me out. It, is, it do not feel good being sick. Now I know Dallas gonna come up on here, but Dallas, I'm blind as a bat. You know what? I will, too. I sure will. And I just want to have fun with my hustle and everybody else have fun. Yeah. I supposed to have a collab with uh, Curling Girl, but I got to see what's going on because I'm not feeling... Part this 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 cold really got me overboard.
Yes, she is a very sweet person. Yeah. Wait a minute, hey, hey, Terminator, you wanna hear something crazy? My mama said, she look like she nuts. Just look at her. Oh, look at that. Mm -mm -mm. She need to take that off. She says now, now she want to start up a YouTube channel just to just go and attack her. I said, no, don't do that. <laughs> like, no. She said she she needs somebody her, um, on her level. I said, shit, nobody's not on her level. She's not on her level. You know, you can't you can't deal with craziness. I could deal with any crazy person in this world, but I can't deal with that one. I don't know who you are, but hello. Can I get that thumbs up? It's me. Oh, oh, oh okay, okay, okay. I'm, I'm watching some ooh, ooh, uh. oh okay okay see because i know i'm using my cell phone i can't read what's up on that but i can see it on the laptop real good but right now though my eyes is blurry play even if I stop out of the room. Oh, okay. Mm-mm-mm. Yeah. I got a few things I got to do. Some of these challenges. But I don't think they're, I don't know what they are. Is they a challenge or what? I don't know. Uh. Oh, okay, okay. Hello? Yeah. My live, I'm, I'm, I have one live. I'm eating some of them pancakes on the stick. Thanks to the groceries. Oh, hell video. Ah, pancakes on a stick. Pancakes on a stick. Is that the ones with the sausages and, and pancakes? I'm definitely not a breakfast eater. I tried, though. The only thing I could handle is cereal. Yes. Uh, okay, of a corn dog. Okay. Then, yes, I've seen them before. I never forget one. Somebody gave me one. I'm sitting there like... What am I supposed to do with this? 
and then bit into it. I knew it was a sausage inside. I'm like, okay, where's the syrup and butter? <laughs> I'm thinking some syrup will come up out of there. I didn't know anything about them. comes in a box of 18 where I'm at and only for $8. Oh, wow, that's not bad. I'm going to have to find some um, and see if they got beef or turkey. I want me a nice size steak with a with a, a yam and a salad. That sounds good. Well, right now I can't swallow nothing. It feel like a porcupine is in my mouth. I wish you would do the cooking. Yeah. You know, I had a lot of people was asking me to do a, a cooking video. I will, but I got to get me a, a, a nice tripod so I can. Because the tripod I have is not going to work for, for my phone. And I still don't know how to get the videos off, off, off my camera, off my... Oh, I think I remember how to do it. Yes, yeah, right here. Yeah, because I got a lot of videos, but I, I definitely want to start doing cooking. I had, let me see, who was that told me? Uh, it's Michelle. She, she said, and then, um, Bite. And uh, there were a few other more people was telling me. Terminator, you, um, the, let me see, what's the name of it? Frog Legs? Oh, wow. Mm -mm -mm. I'm going to make uh, chocolate cover frog legs and a chocolate cover um, um, breasts and then sit there and eat it. That ought to be, no, I know that's going to be nasty. I already know that's going to be nasty. Let me drink a little bit more of this. This stuff probably got cold. Good 
contents out. Yes. Yep. And I got I got all the stuff on on my camera. I just don't know how to take it off. <laughs> One minute I learn how to do this and if I'm not messing with it often, I put it down and forget. clear ones in here. There's all these just red. I got to do grandma next month. it'd be warm instead of April right now because April's still cold to me. Then I still got to, um, my cousin got to hold the camera and stuff, so. Bigfoot is coming in. He walks hard and he talks super loud. I can hear his conversation and the person he talked to on the phone conversation. And I'm supposed, you're not supposed to be like that. <laughs> Something I did not know. Oh, no, 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 no. See how long would I be able to remember that one? Oh, we, 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 we. Oh, we, 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 we. I'm cold. <laughs> Ooh, I'm cold. No, no. That's crazy. Yep, I'm gonna stay up on this thing until till ten. Oh, why did I touch my head? Oh, mm. I'm bundled. Oh, who do you? Who do you? Who do you? I used to, um, I used to love, I, I used to love some crap out of um, Beavis and Butthead. I'd be over this one lady's house, I think it's my uh, ex-girlfriend's um, people, 
So, yeah, yeah, because she always fussing with me. How can you look at that stuff? It's so stupid. It's hilarious. I just sit there and be like, Bono. <laughs> uh, uh, uh. Beavis, shut the hell up, Beavis. <laughs> oh, man. I love some Beavis in my head. Nobody want to know what you got to do with the landlord? Jeez, why do you tell people all your business? Stop telling your business. Stop telling what's in your house. Don't do that. Because now, they just don't rob the house. They just take the whole damn house. You know what I mean? Where they they take the screws out your doorknob so you can't get in. They're going to take the whole house. They ain't going to take no carpet. They're going to take everything out your house. Your house going to be... Your, your house going to be butt naked. When I mean butt naked, they're going to take the wallpaper off the wall. Remove the ceiling fan. The house going to be butt naked. They're going to either take the cords and stuff that's in on the walls and all the pipes. Your house really going to be butt naked. I don't, I don't trust. I don't trust. No, I, ain't let, I don't let people up in my house like that. Because the first thing they be doing is you ever walk in a person's house? You know, for me, I don't care what's in your house. I'm not going to be, ooh, ooh. No, no, you don't do that. You got people who come. I never got somebody who, I mean, I knew them, but I didn't know them, know them like that. Oh, man, you got this. Oh, man, you got that. Don't you touch it. Matter of fact. Squeeze your eyes away from what you're looking at. Because if you ever take anything from me, I'm going to make you a promise. You'll never do it no more. <laughs> and you can you ever get friends who come over to your house and they want to touch everything, fiddle with everything. So it's like, really? Why are you the only one that does that? And and I let you get away with it. Not anymore. Uh uh. I had found a few of my CDs. Couldn't find my CDs for nothing. Went over to his house one day. My music is over there. And I'm sorry. Wait a minute. How did this music get over here? You brought it over here. No. Because that's uh, one of them discs is like 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 a gold like. And I said, well. I already know how much that, that CD worth, and I know for a fact I didn't give it to you. So I'm going to ask you one more time. How did my these three CDs, CDs get over to your house? Oh, man, you remember you, uh, you took them out your car and, and brought them over? Them three CDs. Yeah, man, them three CDs. I would never take them three CDs and want to listen to them and all like that. But that was my stuff. Then he changed his story up. Oh, um, remember I asked you, and you said it was okay to let you borrow, uh, can I borrow some CDs? No, damn well, I won't let you use a fork in my house because you'll scratch it up. Shit, but using that fork for everything else, digging up something outside. Your fork's all bent out of place. No. So, so I'm like, all right, I'm just going to call him uh, uh, Big Jack because I don't want to say his name. So Big Jack, um, he really touching everything in my house. So I'm like, okay, all right, I'm going to have to fix this little wagon. And I did. It was awful, but it works. They always coming over digging in your refrigerator and all this. I'm like, man, you don't get enough doing that. But I scared him so darn bad. Oh, I scared him. Scared him straight. 
I have a sore throat and it seems like it don't want to go away and it feels like it's a porcupine stuck right here. It's all in my throat. Oh. But you got to love your friends. Oh, I put something that was real sticky. And I knew he was going to touch it. So I said, okay, let me slap some of that stuff on it. It was all over his hands. He could, he could. I said, whatever you do, you better not touch nothing else in my house with them hands. Go wash them. He wanted to go wash his hands. He couldn't get that stuff off his hands. It was hilarious. I said, here, here. Here's some rubber gloves. I know you're hungry. One day I had this one chick came over to my house. Her, let me see, it was her, couple, couple, um, her friends, and then this, this on dude who came over. He trying to talk to be friends, man. We ought to be friends, man. You got a lot of stuff in your house, man. We 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 could do a party and all that. I'm like, you only came over with them, right? Good. Stop talking to me. Just shut up. Just shut the hell up. Don't say nothing else. Oh, man, I'm trying to be your friend. I don't need no friends. I got enough friends. I'm like this. Let me tell you something. Once you get at a certain age in your life, you don't need no more friends. You got enough friends. Sure. I don't want to try to get to know a whole nother person all over again. See, my thing of knowing somebody... It got to be three or four years to know somebody. Not just because they live out of town and they come and see you and they go back home. That's not enough. I got to know what, what what you do. But that's just me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Yeah, 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 so I'll be for Don't be asking me to do nothing. I ain't found nothing. He gets on my nerves. I never forget his brother said, "Hey man, can you can you um don't um play no music?" I'm like, "What? Don't play no music? You don't already stay here. You you better leave me alone. I'm playing my music." And he, yeah, hey, Rico, Rico man, I'm really sleepy. Can you turn it down? I turned it up. I mean, I thumped it. Boom, 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 boom. boom. I pay rent. You understand what your brother that I'll make you uh you have um options. I can understand if he was a tenant here, it'd be different. And then I don't play my music all like that either. But when I want to hear some music, oh no, it's time to get mm, dancing. Oh yeah. I want to listen to some music sometime. It's 4.43. If Dallas come in here time by, you gonna do another live video and he ain't came in. I'm here. So, um, man, come on, don't lie. So, um, it, it, it's just a few things uh, of everything. Wait a minute. Terminator is still not here. Yeah. Hey, Rico, I need you. Tell him you found some keys outside. 
I ain't been outside. Oh, okay. Okay. Right, uh-huh. He, he just, ugh, just, he just pointless. He just here on this planet to take up space. That man, that man, something else. Oh, boy, boy. You don't need me. <coughs> All right, I take that back. I was outside. I went to go get my mail. Oh, well. That's not being outside. Just getting your mail. Two different things. I don't know where everybody's at no more. They don't want to come in and speak to me. But I'm here. I'm here. I'm here. I'm here. I'm here. It's bad enough, I can't keep my eyeballs open. 61 minutes. Let me, let me read this stuff here. I can't see nothing. I need, I, I need my uh, magnifying glass. See, can I take it? Cause I got trouble with asthma. So certain medicine, if you got trouble with asthma, you shouldn't be taking it. A rash. This I can give you a rash. What the hell they got in here? Itching powder. They got names on here you never heard of. Now, ask your doctor before if you have liver disease, heart disease, high blood pressure, thyroid disease. Oh, wow. Trouble yawning due to the. And I might want to take this. I'm a man, I gotta pee. I can't be sitting there having trouble and I can't pee. I'm gonna take the therapy, because I know about this. I ain't taking nothing. It's gonna make me better, but make me worse at the same time. You know, I just don't get it. You ever read some of your medicine? Medicine can be scary. Oh, you take five of them, but if you take one more, you'll die. Mm. I'm 
can see nothing smooth, you are therefore into a fast, powerful, hot tea. Uh, powerful, smooth relief of cold, uh, cold, silver cold, and flu symptom. Ooh, I definitely need this because this is what it feels like a flu symptom. A flu symptom. Hey. careless. Super careless. I've been living, I've been living, I've been living over here for a minute. I ain't never lost my key. I ain't never, ever lost my keys. That's where he, he, he's, he's a big baby with sucking on a pacifier. Just I know y'all can hear that, but I apologize. You know, you got some people bored, they need to take a Q-tip and pull that wax out, and it's gonna come out. And when you feel it, it's gonna hit your shoulder. <laughs> Just soda job. That's how much they got up in them ears. But it's good to keep some of that air wax inside your ears. Let me tell you something. You may not want to believe it, but if you ever have a cold sore, you ever get a cold sore on your lip or feel it coming, take some of that air wax out your ears and rub it on there. And I guarantee you within a couple seconds, it'll be gone. Don't sit there and wait and you go on and buy you some medicine. You are, your body is medicine. I'm happy I finished that. That was nasty. I, ever since I was a kid, I never liked cough syrup. And they have another one. They did, they did, they did. I put it right there in that tea. I ain't drinking that stuff. Yep, I'm here, I'm here. Oh, shut up. You ever lived on the street, people literally drive you crazy? And they don't want nothing. They just want to see what you're doing. They want to be nosy. Uh, 
I just want to move. But I hate moving. I don't want to touch nothing but moving. Next one I'm going to get is the ones who put the stuff in the box and they move it themselves. I ain't doing this moving. I'd rather pay somebody to do this. I don't want to carry a damn shoestring. I might fall down the darn steps. Because I'm clumsy. Especially when I got to take stuff up the steps or down the steps. Hey, Dallas, I'm here. I know you can see that. I'm going to come down and get that puppy in the um, truck. And we're going to ride off in the, in the dust. <laughs> Michelle, you better help me get up on here. I'm going to take a bite out of your peanut butter jelly sandwich. You can keep the milk. Nothing. That is so crazy. I try to do some potatoes or something, something soft, easy to go down, I guess. Yeah, potatoes will work. I, uh, oh, yeah. It's a beautiful day, Gamunda. I am so sleepy. Like I just want to sit there, sit there and close my eyelids and meditate. But I'm cold. I'm literally freezing.
and give me something to eat. I'm still here, guys. Oh, man, oh, man. Uh, I got to get out of this little spot here. I'm just I'm just gonna stay up on this thing till ten o'clock, you know. I'm gonna try my best anyway. Thanks for coming back. Oh boy, oh boy, I am so sleepy. But I'm trying to get some uh, watch time hour in. Seventy-seven minutes already. You know what, I really hate doing live videos. It's hard to tell people don't play music, but OMG, I can't even last three hours on live. <laughs> last time I did um, six hours. No, eight hours. Eight hours, I don't know how I did it. I kind of dozed off for a hot second, and then uh, I turned back over and I see somebody in my live. I'm like, okay. I said, I can't do that no more. <clears throat> I know try to go do live videos like 30 minutes or something. I want to try to get them live. I mean, get my uh, watch time hours in. That's the reason why I, I do long videos. Because right now it's like 2, 2.28 or... Or two, is it 238 or 228? I, I, I can't remember which one it is. Mm. You see, you can't do uh, three hours. I just find me, like this chair right here is comfortable. Or if I sit somewhere on my couch, it's comfortable. Nope, I can't. <laughs> I'll be trying to screw. I'll be, I'll be, I'll be uh, doing these live videos. PCP was on my live last night. Oh, that's that's good. Yeah. She is she a wonderful person. Yeah, she she'll pop on my live baby now and then. She was always been caring. Yes, sure have. Yeah. I'm still um 
don't know. I just don't want to respond to her because of all the trolls. Oh, yeah, yeah. Then they will go on. Yeah. Talk, talking crazy, silly stuff. Yeah, Percy Peel step uh step in every every once in a while on my on my live. I caught her a few times on there. Mm -hmm. I cannot wait to go to sleep. Uh, oh, she can't hold it down. Oh, yeah, she sure can. That's one thing about her. She sure can. Please be, is they real? I don't know. Oh yeah, she got some good music. And she ain't she's not ashamed to say it. Oh yeah, her and her husband. Oh yeah. Her brother, her mom. I got two other people up in here. I don't know who that is. No, she ain't afraid to be a big girl and still. Right, right. Yes, I am too. I mean, she's just uh, proof of she ain't afraid to do nothing. She gonna do it. And she wouldn't care if you don't like it or you do like it. Yeah. You're right. No thanks. Great YouTube care. A creator. Yeah, you right. Sure do. That, that woman, that woman knows she don't bite her tongue. If she gonna tell you, she gonna tell you. like her um her sense of humor you know <laughs> oh, some of these people on my street they know they can wear a name out you remember when that music came out I forgot the rapper's name that way when that way had came out these two people would dig it in the ground I'm so tired of hearing that way. I'm like, oh no. I want a popsicle, but if I either try to eat it, I. I I don't want to be too cold. Be freezing. Uh, 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 uh. Yeah, yeah. 
sorry I'm not doing too much talking. My head is like thumping. Like I'm just freezing. And that that's crazy when I'm when I'm cold and I'm not cold. That's a terrible feeling. I really hope you get better. So yes, you work. Right. Yeah, yeah. I do. I have. I literally have a fever. I'm not as perky like I'm always usually be. Oh man. What's the temperature down there, um, Terminator? Cause I know here it's like 40 some, almost 50 degrees. <laughs> how far how far is Fort Wayne uh from you? Cuz I got families in uh Fort Wayne, Texas. It's one million degrees. <laughs> if it had been one million, I don't think y'all be all be baked like a piece of chicken. It's not far at all. Oh, okay. Yeah, because I know I'm supposed to be going down there visiting. And I know I got family stay down there. <laughs> 70 degrees. I wonder what 70 degrees up here. Oh, I would love to meet you too. Oh, yeah. Yeah. We definitely need to do a meet and greet. I want you to that shit. <laughs> they be like, oh Lord, them two them two to, together. Oh, they about to tear tear Texas up. Nah, nah, we ain't gonna do that. I be like <laughs> I'm fine up. Oh boy, boy. Wee. Mm, mm, mm. Oh, I, I ought to. I was. Well, I better not say too much. There's people up in here, and they just. I don't know if they ear hustling. They don't want to say nothing. I go down and put an animal suit on and meet that one person we we both know. Scare the crap out of that person. Make that person poop their pants. <laughs> I know who talking about <laughs> oh yeah <laughs> I would be the hold on let me see oh <laughs> Ooh, wait let's see what just to see what that person will do 
<laughs> I, I put that person on world star hip hop. <laughs> <laughs> they did say they were always too much. <laughs> right, right, right. <laughs> they sure did too. <laughs> Oh, boy, boy. We young. We ain't gonna bite our tongue too much. <laughs> wow. I have four people on here and one person talking to me. But I also got four thumbs up, too, so. Yep, I actually believe that too. Because that person can't um, mingle back um, with us. So that person want to just send a send, um, patrol over here and see what's going on. I will pull down my pants and stick my finger in my butt so y'all go back and let that person know. Ha 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 ha. Now that's funny. <laughs> Pull that person right out of my butt. Like, whoo, you've been up there a little too long. this up. Can't, oh, I can't eat nothing. I just don't have the appetite. And my mom was going to talk about take some tomato soup. I don't like tomato soup. She says your problem. You don't like nothing. I don't like um B.A. I don't like BA, I don't like tomato soup. It's nasty. Then I told her, I said, I don't want no more diarrhea. You tripping. No, the wine was already enough to expand. Now I know what a baby feels like. Uh, I'm chew if y'all want to know, I'm chewing on a uh, a cough drop. Mm -hmm. So all the rest of my mind is going to come in here and talk about, man, they're going to hit me up on Instagram. Man, you need to do a live video. I just did a live video. I understand you have to work. And I know what time y'all people get off. I'm going to ask my doctor, can he move anything from, I know I'm supposed to get my tonsils taken out, but I'm terrified. I am so terrified. I do not like pain. And they said that is the worst pain in your throat. It feel like you got a stripped throat. 
and a porcupine and everything else down your throat. I said, nope, nope, I think I passed. Because, and I'll never forget, I, um, my friend had his tonsils taken out. He said, hey, man. And, and he had his tonsils taken out. And he said, man, if I knew what this stuff feel like, I would never get it done. How long did it stay sore? He said, man, it feel like actually two weeks and a half, almost three weeks. I said, nope, I can't go through that. I'm cool. I ain't going through that. Oh, no. I have never had my tonsils out. Yeah, but they, 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 they be getting on me, though. Why are you so hard-headed? I'm not hard-headed. I just don't like pain. Never had issues. Oh, okay. Yeah, I... I they they told me it was so red that it needs to be uh, removed. But these things ain't doing nothing to me. I don't usually catch colds like this. But they talking about, well, you got to have them taken out. It'd be good for you. Yeah, God gave it to us for a reason. You saying take them out, but I'm telling you, what the Lord, why, why would God um, put them in there? Because when they cut something off you, you never be the same. This is so true. <laughs> oh shoot. I I had my eye uh, fair fair play. So, yeah, I'm gonna do a story time. It's something I really wanna talk about. Maybe it might help me and help others too. People who really suffer with asthma or, you know, what's the experience like, especially when you try to talk to dumb doctors. You know, you got a lot of smart doctors, but the dumb doctors, the ones I call bed manners are bad. Cause they got some nasty bed manners. I never forget I had this one doctor. He came in the room sat down and had his lip up like this. I like, either you must be smelling something really bad or you just don't want to be in here. I used to mess with that doctor so bad now to the point he get a kick out of me. He said, do I really act like that? I'm like, hell yeah, you act like that. True, I don't. <laughs> Dumb doctors just. Yeah, <laughs> all day. <laughs> oh, shoot. Nah, right, boy, I told that doctor off it. And he said, I don't, I don't come off like that, do I? Shit, yes, you do. You come off like that bad, too. Are you married? Because I'm sure your wife should be able to tell you that. Or she must be one of the most snot-nosed hussies. I ain't bite my tongue. I tell a doctor just how I feel about it. <laughs> now, now if they're good doctors, I talk to them like it, like me and you talking. I never forget one day. They laugh at me as well. <laughs> Oh, I told this one doctor, I said, man, you went to school to be a doctor, right? Did you leave something from, leave something in the past or something? Because your brain is not with you. And I always tell them, I said, it feels like y'all go to school for whatever you want to be, but y'all come out brainwashed. I told them, I said, pretend like you're not a doctor. And when you in enough pain and understand, don't talk in Dr. Fern. Talk like a little bit. I don't know how to talk ghetto. And I, I, I ain't going to try that. But 
talk like uh, you understand what I'm talking about, but in a different language, not a doctor language. Um, brain cell. Oh, yeah. And the doctor said, Rico, you are so crazy, but now I understand where you're coming from. I like, no, nah, but when y'all go in and talk to a patient, don't pretend like you, you don't know what's going on, because nine out of ten you do. Y'all, 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 y'all attitudes is just sucks. And when you fix your bed manner problems, then you know, that'll work. But ever since that doctor came in with a snot nose, now, now he's a good doctor. Because now I know just how he is. Every time I see him, I mean, I don't care if I'm walking down the hallway and I see him, I got my lip on He just be sitting there laughing. <laughs> I'm like, But I do go to a good hospital, so. But I haven't been in there for a while. Who is watching? I see. Two, six people and I don't. I don't know who keep doing that. I like talking guys every day. Right, right. You know, I mean. That's what I'm saying. There's four people up in here. One minute goes to five. Oh, wait a minute. Hey, Ed Time. What's going on? Uh, I can tell. I guess you knew here. Because I ain't never seen you before. And if you was in here, I apologize. I just don't remember. Nothing much. Yeah, at that time, Mukbang is saying what's up. I mean, just come in and just talk and appreciate it. Until he's sitting there just listening on the outside. Come on in so I get to see who you are. I like talking to people. I'm a people person to a certain extent. <laughs> I like people, but when you start talking stupid, oh, okay. All right. Remember, I'm a telemarketer. I let loose on you fast and before you say, ow. <laughs> oh, okay. Better lock that door. Oh yeah. I'm glad you here. That's all right. So terminate, you know who that time is. Okay. That that's good. This is one hell. Oh, okay. Oh, okay, okay. Yeah, so. I never forget one day. This ain't no lie either. I've been where. So sick where. Doctors didn't want to keep me in intensive care, and i never forget one day I was up in there for three weeks. Yeah. It's cold. Oh, okay. Okay, welcome to the family, Etwine. Yeah, um, I never met him. 
Oh, okay. I never met him. Okay, okay. And so one day they kept me up in there. Boy, I gave this one doctor the blues. I'm like, I can't go home, but I can go against medical advice. Okay, all right. So I do that. They let me leave out. Let me leave out the two doors. And find out I couldn't go nowhere. I just could not breathe. I was like, I said, I can't deal with him. He's such a moron. I can't do nothing. I got to lay up in this bed like, like I'm dying. I ain't dying. I, I, I got trouble with breathing. I got to sit up in this hospital, especially in here. Oh, this is driving me crazy. <laughs> then I never forget this one doctor. I think she was a guy or she was a female. I don't know. She had a mustache and a beard thicker than mine. And I don't hire a guy here on my face. So, talking about Rico, call sight, call sight. I'm like, sight? Well, you crazy ass hussy. You the one who coming up in the room uh, saying this and saying that, but now I need sight. So when sight people did finally came up in the room, they sat there and talked to me. They said, ain't nothing wrong with him. <laughs> I'm perfectly fine. <laughs> <laughs> I said, what y'all need to do, y'all talk to me. Y'all need to go talk to her. There's something seriously wrong with that woman. And at that time, I mean, really at that time, I didn't, I mean, I give people respect, but this one here, I called her bull diger and half a man, half woman. <laughs> and you trying to walk around trying to jiggle that stiff butt. <laughs> I used to make that lady so bad. Who wants to make her so mad? So the next morning she came in. She talking about, hold up. I just wanted to say, um, can we please make this be a good day? Because I can't deal with you. Shit, I can't deal with you either. I ain't going to lie. And I'm stuck in here. And I have to look through the glass window of everybody sitting out or people walking by. I can't walk down the hallway. I can't do nothing. Y'all got me tied up on everything. But I didn't realize just how bad my uh, illness was. So, and then this other doctor came in, and, I, and he was talking. And I said, who are you? And then this other lady going to say something. And I said, this must be your mother. Because y'all y'all two had just like, it's not my mother. Uh, I worked with her. Your mother. She's the mother of all, you know. So I'm sitting there like, yeah, this is going to be a good one today. I said, I'm going to have a ball. And every time I kept saying some off the wall stuff, other people would sit there laughing who was in the room. And I said, why do I need to have all y'all doctors looking over me and it should be just one doctor? All you got to do is tell your goons what's going on then you don't have to come back in here goons goons who are you calling the goons i'm calling you a goon that's a goon and that's goomily goon goon because that lady is something wrong with her she she needed she need a brain a brain search i don't know if y'all do brain search in here but they need it and there's a lot of doctors as a little off off they arm rockers and i never forget this one man this pain management uh, doctor came in I mean, he was so far up his nose and pulling out and playing with him, wiping all in on his jacket. And then, all right, I'm such and such. I'm cool. I don't, I don't need you touching my hand. You up there uh, digging all the wax out your damn nose. I don't, I don't, I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. He said, it's nothing wrong with having boogers on your hand. I'm going to tell you something. I don't know if there's anything wrong with what you do, but to me, that's germs. And I got enough problems as it is, and I got to be up and stuck up in this hospital with y'all damn fools. So, um, time going by, and then they finally said, well, you're not going to go home from here. You're going to go um, downstairs. I'm like, yes, I get out of here 
and don't have to deal with y'all. What happened next two days later? I could not move. Could not do nothing. All I know, I woke up and I could see the tubes and, and I said, I'll be damn, I'm back on a respirator already again. Then I just left from this place. What happened? <laughs> you know, I wanted to know what happened. They said, well, we let you go downstairs and you was doing fine and your asthma had trigger and it went to uh, cold blue. And I'm like, wow. I'm like, can I just breathe and move around just for once and not have to deal with none of this stuff? But you got to deal with it. So anybody with a disease out there, stop teasing people and stuff. Just try to understand their illness before you say anything about anything. Because you might have some of your family deal with all kinds of illness. But... Like I said, I haven't been sick. I maybe went to the doctor once, maybe twice. No, once, twice. And uh, they said, you don't already be back up in here no more. I said, I sure don't. I don't want none of y'all medicine. Phew. The delight make you cuckoo. You be itching, scratching, and the medicine, and you be still scratching. Too. I don't want no medicine that's going to do all that to me. And I never forget I was put on this patch. Uh, I, oh, it's called fentolin. I was on that patch. Ooh, they put it on my chest and feel nice and cool. But this, med they, this medicine was, um, I don't know how it worked, but within every so many hours, I better get that medicine. But it was a patch. Boy, when that, that medicine did kick in, I'm like, dude. So I had doctors come in. I got talking to them. I can hear myself talking to them, but nothing that makes sense. I'm like, I'm just, I was just like gone from off the medicine. I never forget, boy, they to come in and run like, well, Rico, back for another dose. I ain't get this one out of my system yet. Y'all going to fix that and give that to me? I've been on almost every medicine you can think of. It's now to the point, I don't want none of it. I don't want no Dilaudid. I don't want no Tylenol. I don't want no baby aspirin, no cough syrup. And I don't need none of that medicine to make you uh, loopy and goofy at the same time. I never forget this one medicine they gave me. What was that? It wasn't morphine. Um, oh, oxycodone. Not oxycodone, oxycodone. <laughs> and, and this is what makes it so crazy is I, uh, sitting there taking this medicine and they said this is oxycodone okay so i'm thinking okay oxycodone is the same thing of oxycodone you know so i took it gave me two of them and then with them maybe it was time for lunch i'm sitting there this ain't no lie I seen four of them come in that room. And every time that person got closer, I was I was jumping ready to jump out, out of the bed. And I'm like, why is four of y'all carrying? I can't eat all that. Why one, two, three, four? Or is it four? Four of y'all. Yeah, it's four of y'all. I, I don't I don't need this one person giving me a tray. Take all the rest of them trays back. <laughs> And that girl kept talking. She said, um, it's just me. Then uh, why is it for y'all if it's just me? I'm not stupid. You know, and then I had the nurse come in. They like, 
Rico is under heavy medication. Rico is not under no heavy medication. Stop telling them lies. Yeah, I was under heavy medication. Every time they do, they put another bag up. I'm like, oh, I can't do this. That's why I say medicine is not good for you. Because you got some medicine will help the pain, but you got some medicine where it'll make your um, breathing decrease where your oxygen level will start dropping, CO will start kicking in, and the next minute you out of whack and you can't breathe, and oh, it's such it's such a headache. Yeah, and I had did some crazy things too. I never forget one day I was in the hospital. Oh, 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 oh. <clears throat> but I know my dad, he must really love me because that was twice I did that. <clears throat> this IV kept beeping. Beep, beep. So I hit the button. I'm like, excuse me, this thing's beeping. Oh, we have somebody come down there. Beep, beep. Hours going by. One whole hour went by. And I said, uh, lady, you said a whole hour ago. This thing is beeping. It's getting on my nerves. This ain't no lie. At least I, I could tell about it. I, I was in that. I was my my. Anyway, all they heard is push. I threw that thing out the window. The whole IV hit the ground. It was people there, and they, people were like, watch out. And I'm looking down like, oops, my bad. It was beeping and get beeping and got on my last nerve. And then they're like, Rico, no, you did not throw the IV out the window. The blood was um, going back up in the bag. I was tired of it. All that beeping, beep. Beep. And you got people, nurses walk past your room like they don't want to do nothing. No, that's a pain in the butt. Beep. Beep. Like something's backing up 24-7. Beep. And that, that ain't the first time that happened either. <laughs> well, what they had to write out a check and he like, don't you do that no more. Next time you gonna pay for it. I like that couldn't be no more than a few hundred. Oh yeah, a few hundred, all right. So I threw the second one out the window. But said this time I took it off the pole and slung it out the window. And they like Rico, no. Why you just won't let them do their job? They ain't doing their job. They sitting there laughing, hee hee ha. They don't want to come in that thing, beep, 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 beep. All that beeping sound. You're going to get tired of it eventually. So yeah, I slunk it out the window. And it hit the ground again and splatter. Oh boy. When that day came, the little cops, and they like, well, you know you got to pay for that. All right, a couple hundred dollars ain't nothing. When I found out how much that damn um, IV thing cost, I said, all that? All that money for that piece of shit? Excuse my French, but that piece of poop? No wonder. It, it should have a way it should cut off so it won't be so noisy. It's bad enough the thing is tied to us. I'm going to be good. Dealing with all that noisy stuff. I never forget I got upset with this doctor, but I wasn't upset with him. They they couldn't find no vein fast enough. When I used to marry, I looked at that doctor, I looked at him, I said, I'm gonna get you. Oh yeah, but I'm screaming and hollering all too, but they said I passed out from it. And this would probably be what my third time having that done. 
drilling in your leg to get a vein. Oh, oh whoa, 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 whoa. I'm like, you know what? Y'all to knock a person out before y'all give somebody a drilling in your leg. What is wrong with you? Boy, that doctor stayed by that door. I like, come here. I said, come here. He's like, uh-uh. I said, come here. I want to ask you something. Oh, you ain't going to come. I'm getting up. Boy, every time I, I took a step, he kept looking. I got close, and then he um, moved out, ran across from the, the next room over. I said, come here. Don't make me come in and get you. I want to ask you something. What the hell is wrong with you? <laughs> I kept telling them doctors to stop. Uh, everybody hold me down. He can't get loose. Oh, man. It feel like they literally cut your leg off. It's the worst pain. The worst. That, that ain't pain. That's torture. Torture of being in the hospital and have to go through that procedure. And, you know, I remember we watched a little kid go through that. They had me sitting there like, oh, I hope I'll never get that because that look like that painful. That boy, he cried so bad, he, he about to ready to spit out his damn tongue. And after, now I know what that, that, that stuff feels like, I won't put that on my worst enemy. And you know what would make it so crazy? I have no enemies on this side. It just seems like it's all on YouTube. <laughs> That, that 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 is the most craziest part. But hey, it is what it is. The cookie in the factory. Oh boy boy. And I finally seen that doctor one day. I was um I had to go up there for a checkup. I said, hey buddy. I when he saw me, the the stare on his face. And he said, I thought you was going to kill me. Who thinks like that? I mean, cause when I touched him, he did like this. Who, who, who? I'm sorry. I was just trying to save your life. I know you're trying to save my life. I ain't mad about that. I told you I want to talk to you. Just give you a piece of my mind down. I got a thumbs down. Thanks a lot, uh, you little shithead. Wow. Uh, them, 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 them true haters, trolls for for life. But it's it's all good though. Lucky I don't know who you is. I already got uh like eighteen people, and they not YouTubers. But when they do become YouTubers, and uh, if I, once I get my one thousand uh, subscribers. And I'm start doing giveaways. I'm gonna remember them 18 people. What's up, fam? There we go. Oh, what's up, Dallas? What's going on? And I'm always gonna remember remember them 18 people's faces. I ain't gonna remember their faces, but their names, yeah. Cause if you ever become a YouTuber, I'm I'm gonna hit block real fast. I'm gonna block you and keep on moving. Because them damn trolls are something else. Oh, damn heathens. You got some rest. I'm just on, Dallas, to be honest with you, the rest is not doing it. I'm cold. I got a sore throat. And if I touch my head, it hurts. And I'm going to take this Theraflu uh, once I get off this thing at, at night. Cause I'm gonna stay on here till 10 o'clock or at least nine at the most. Yeah. Oh, let me tell you, I, I told uh, Mukbang Terminator, let me tell you something. Yesterday, and I know you gonna sit there and laugh. That was what the woman, the woman you was in last night. No. My friend, my lady friend, she had to use the bathroom. Then I told her, I hurry up, hurry up. I got to go. I got to go, you know. And I, I, well, oh, I pooped in my pants. 
I literally, it came out, blah, blah, blah. I'm like, ooh, that's what diapers feel like? Nice and warm and slippery and slimy. I had to throw all my clothes in the iron washer. She on the floor crying. Yep, that's how she was, crying. Laugh, I mean, she laughed so hard, boy. She said, oh my God, it's actually coming out your pants. Oh, shut up. <laughs> she said, well, I'm going to take and put your clothes in the album. And I watched her. I said, good. Then I had to go and take a shower and stuff. Oh, that, is, that was so embarrassed. That's because I had trouble with diarrhea. All of it started coming down on me yesterday. But I also think it, it, it's the muscles I had. It did not agree with me. But this is something all total. I'm, I, yeah, I got, I got a cold. I got a cold. And I, and I'm freezing. I'm literally freezing. I got to see if I can eat something. At least try. I, I got some uh, extra potatoes from my, uh, uh, Did I boil all of them? I sure did. My little um my uh my pig feet. I mean, oh I think that's the second time I said that. My chicken feet. So how was your day at work? I want that little puppy. It's just so it's so adorable. <laughs> I'll let you go tell me that's a full grown dog. <laughs> Is that a husky? Or no, it's not a Labrador. Cause I know what a Labrador. Got to be a husky. <laughs> whoa, 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 whoa. It's a beautiful day in Gamunda. And it's always very nice in Rico's neighborhood. We had Miss Freak in the um in the bank today. Miss Freak, Miss Freak, we don't really see her come in as much, but she was in there. And she pointing all the way down. Mm, I want you, mm, I want you. Mm, there's some things I want to do with you. I'm like, when she came down and looked at me, she said, you know what? I I like big boys. I wanna know what you better do. I see, don't get don't get it twisted. <laughs> but I couldn't say what I want to say to her in there. But she she's she's always nice, but I but we all think she's horny. Every now and then I go to that bank, I see her in there. I'm like, would you like to be in here or something? Yeah, I like him. I was like, oh no. Oh we It is cold in here. Can y'all hear that? Oh boy boy. Where's Michelle? Well, mukbang terminator. I 
ain't nobody saying nothing. I'm just going to sit in here and just look and meditate for a little bit and use my monkey sound. Ooh, 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 ah, 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 ah. Oh God, my throat. My mom got time my God that was salt water. Salt water don't help. Not for no throat. I don't know what's wrong with that. Alright, light salt in my mouth. I'm tired, y'all. I got two hours in, so that's good. But just right now, I'm about to ready to plug up my blanket and stay up underneath that bad boy. It's a terrible feeling here, boy. Daddy talks so loud. He, you think he's right here. Just loud. Thank God I don't stay downstairs. I was going to move downstairs at first. But I'm like, no, mm -mm, I'm, I'm, I'm glad that did not happen. I guess these people want me to move downtown. Well, I guess I'd be close to them, but and the one other guy supposed to um, I'm supposed to get. They was gonna sponsor me, but uh, it's like he ain't gonna never come out to hospital. He keep going in rehab, and then they have to keep taking him back. I forgot what, what kind of disease it was, but it's messing him up. He, they, uh, they was telling me he, it was, I think, seven of them all together. His one brother's already gone from this di uh, disease, and their father passed away with it. The mother don't have it. giving me watch time hours, that's wonderful. I'm not mad, but I know I'm freezing. Oh, oh, that's a terrible feeling when you cold and you
You can't do nothing about it. Oh, we. Yeah. I'm cold, my hair. Well, my head don't hurt. When I touch my head, it hurts. If y'all ready to go, let me know. It's like slow. I mean, because I'm I'm literally I'm just freezing. I have a cold, so but I just wanna put out something for my family. Yeah. Thanks for asking. So I don't got too much to say. Usually I'm up and sparky, but this this right here really gets me down. Super cold. Mm, mm, mm. I can feel the goosebumps on my skin. Oh, okay. <laughs> I got five people within two hours. That's that ain't bad. One person is watching. <clears throat> I might do a ASMR um, video tonight. I'm thinking about it. No, I don't think I can. Because once I go to sleep, I'm taking this medicine. Oh, <laughs> Everybody at. I'm still here. Okay. So is this nice where you stay at? I mean, it's like. 47, 48 up here right now.
Oh, uh, it's like 35. Woo wee. I need it to be warm. I need to move somewhere where it's decent at. I need that nice weather. I miss Florida. I do. That's my home state, but I miss, I miss, I miss being in Florida. I represent Florida. There's always something to do 24 seven. Hello, hello. Two people in here. One person's talking. that weather I did ask Trying to keep myself woke. Where everybody at? They're all gone. They don't want to be bothered with me. Okay, there's two people up in here. I don't want to say nothing. It's okay. It's all right. You don't have to talk. Time is oh, okay. Yeah, two hours in, so that's good. It helps, it helps. Um, since last year, um, October, yeah, ain't been that long. And, uh, do I hate it or do I like it? Uh, it's like in between.
But yeah, I kind of enjoy it. You just got a lot of haters on this thing. Are you a a YouTuber? At that's time, are you a YouTuber? Oh shit! Oh, I watch. You ought to become a YouTuber. It's cool. It's 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 fun. It's fun sometimes. It just you have to come up constantly with some um stuff. That's the only hard part. I hate that song that way. Hey Michelle, what's going on? What's new? Mukbang Terminal was over here for a minute. I enjoy his company. Oh, I can't do nothing. Let me do this. I got a a little small cold for right now. Hold up, y'all. I got to turn. Hold up. Hit mute. What was your favorite YouTube video to make? Um, let me see. YouTube video I made. Ah, uh, that's that's a good one. I got so many of them. I can't hardly keep up. <coughs> yeah, but I can't remember which video. Now, I'm gonna say the okra. The okra put me through something. Oh, uh -huh. um. Reason. Uh man, I'd be glad this over with. I don't want to mess with this. I'm literally freezing. Oh boy, oh boy. We had two hours, two people in. Five thumbs up. One thumbs down. I 
I just don't get it. You know you ain't gonna like the video. Why why just come up on here and give me thumbs down? What did I ever do to you but love you? to everybody else pop up in here. I don't want to knock it down, but I got two people in here. I don't know who's in here. Got to talk to me so I know. Um, I'm gonna say like Prissy P. Uh, uh, picture us rolling, muscle and marriage, and Corey and Carmen, uh, Nick and King. Um, Trey and Gillian, or, or I forgot his brother's name. Or uh, that's his cousin, more likely. And uh, CJ So Cool. But who's inspired me to do YouTube is actually uh, Picture Us Rolling and, and Prissy P. They made it so easy and simple. I'm like, whoa, now they got more new stuff on this thing. Cause when I, when I first did it, it was a little while back and I didn't, I didn't stick with it. And, and I started somewhere like 06, 07. If I had stuck with it since then, I probably been on top by right now. But I didn't like the camera all in my face and we was doing too many darn pranks and this and I was getting tired. And then my friend got killed and I said, well, I don't want to do it now. Yeah. <laughs> Ooh, we need four more hours. Four more hours. Great. I don't know if I made a stick with four hours. I might have to cut this bad boy short. Wow, yeah, I'm about to get off this thing. I got to get me some rest. <coughs> and I'm freezing. And that's that's another thing. It's not good. So I'm really freezing. Yeah. 
No, it's going to do all the way to 10, but. Uh, no, but it's not going to work. All right, guys, I'm about to get off. Um, I'm very tired. It's, usually, this is not like me, but, yeah. So, y'all have a wonderful, blessed day. And I'll see y'all tomorrow for my four. I'm trying to take it all the way to four to ten. But right now, I just can't do it. I'm literally freezing too much. Have a great day, Rico. You too, Antoine. Thank you so much, bro. All right, y'all have a wonderful, blessed day. I'm up out of here. Oh, it's three people here. Oh, it's two. Come on. All right. Sorry about... Oh, it's, it's not a story. I don't know what should I do. But I got to stop it, though. Hey, it's Michelle. Bye, bye, Rico. I came black. Yeah, I'm not feeling too good. This cold is kicking my butt, and, and I'm freezing still. You know, and it's warm in my house, but I'm just cold. And I got to get up underneath the blanket. All right, get well soon. I sure will. Thank you. Okay. All right. Love, everybody. Bye.